How's it going YouTube? Red Impact here, checking in after the heavyweight fight between Justice Hooney and Joe Goodall. Big shout out to everyone who viewed my breakdown of the fight before. And thanks for hitting like and subscribe guys. It makes me want to make more content for you. So, Justice Hooney, Joe Goodall. Now I didn't go with the pay-per-view on this one. I figured 60 bucks was a bit much. Sounds like from the highlights and the commentary I did here that it was a pretty good battle. So it went the full 10 rounds. Three judges scored 190, 98, 92, 98, 93, and all scored in Hooney's favour. So it seemed a good local battle between two strong heavyweights. Hooney, quick hands, lots of speed, lots of combinations as we'd expect from him. Goodall threw some big ones, but any time he tried to get the better of Hooney, Hooney just kept bringing it to him. YouTube, I was definitely wrong with this one. I had Goodall winning. I thought he'd done the preparation and done the work. But for Hooney, this has been a good opportunity to show what the young bloke's capable of. He's only 23. Another W under his belt now. So 23-year-old Justice Hooney is now the IBF Pan Pacific, WBO Oriental, OPBF and WBC Australasian heavyweight champion. It was said prior to the fight that this would open up some new opportunities and put the winning fighter into the top 15 rankings for some of the world title belts. So new opportunities will hopefully start to open for Justice Hooney. There might still be some domestically. There's still McCain. He's 21 and 0. That would be a pretty good fight. They're both pretty solid fighters. But um, if you're a Justice's camp, you'd be seeking those bigger, high-paying opportunities starting to move up through those rankings. And who knows? Might even see a world title opportunity down the track. Thanks again, YouTube, for sticking with me. I was wrong in this one, but uh, hey, that's boxing, isn't it? Please hit the like, subscribe. Please drop your comments in. Have a good night. Cheers.